This is Billy Ruth Hopkins Futurichi on KCIW 100.7 on your FM dial, right here in beautiful downtown Brookings, where almost every day is a beautiful day and we can always choose to say yes. Life is indeed very, very good. Well, you may remember that this is a work of pure, unadulterated allegorical fiction, or what J.R.R. Tolkien liked to call feigned history. So, sit back, relax, suspend all disbelief, and let's continue with our tale. Angela becomes Commander Athandra in her dream, determined to rescue Angelita, return her to Shivano, and save Earth from final destruction in the solar tsunami. She, Ithurgis, and Tsubasa convince Lizard Zergo to rise up against his bullying lizard comrades. Victory is at hand. The forest fairies give Anheli to the last remaining PCRTD, which will transport her instantaneously back to Shavano. As the Thurgis writes a musical scroll, Pop God decides to produce it as a dream, with Angela in the starring role as Commander Athandra. Let's listen in. These orbs must all be documented and catalogued, taken safely to the Simeon Galaxy, where I must find Anelita and Ethurges the cat on the planet of Ethereus. As I touched each shard of broken orb, I could feel it trying to communicate through shifting static, or softening to near gel, then emitting a high, unbearable, dying cat howl. I could make nothing out, really, just bits and pieces of words or phrases. They are howling, almost shrieking, oh my ears. Careful, everyone. Some of them might might be demonic, overtaking your body. To fake news, hatred lies. Terror is all this lust, greed, power. It's all your fault. 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 Oh, 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 last year, listeners, these horrors should have been a warning for anyone paying attention, which, of course, most earthlings were not. Some, however, were even trying to save the planet from destruction, but not enough. And the critical mass moved inextricably toward annihilation. Some managed to hold on to noble optimism, but it became all too futile. Of course, I thought we would manage to save them, or at least go back and rewrite their story, getting them back on the right path, find a road map in the rubble of the last destruction away back before it all went wrong, but no. They had created themselves into their own self-destructive image, deluded themselves down the internet rabbit holes, sucking them in like lemmings over the eternal abyss. Ah, humanity, what could I do? You must save Angelita, Commander Asandra. What, 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 huh, what, 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 what are you, what are you all talking about? You must save Angelita. Nothing is more essential to universal survival itself, Commander Asandra. You do realize that, don't you? Or, 
well, well, but of course, but how, how should I proceed? We shall lead you to the seventh wormhole, which will take us to Ethereus, where we live in the forest between the rivers of Let Go and Regenerate. But we must take care not to land on the banks of the river of love. Well, well, well why is that? Because, dear Commander Athandra, centuries ago, the river of love carved out an eternal abyss, but the bridge across the eternal abyss washed out last winter, and, well, we've not had a chance to rebuild it. A bit short-sighted, don't you think? Pointing fingers, are we, Commander? Oh, no, 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 of course not. Sorry, wait. How? Oh, well, why am I so old? Look, who, look, who am I? Pay attention, Angela. You are Commander Asandra, dreaming of your future. Listen to your inner voice, the way the surges. We sing of recurring dreams and visions, your highest entelechy. Pay close attention to your inner voice. It is the blueprint of the best you can be. Now, it is certain, now you have a choice. Will you turn away or make a difference? Mountains are moving. Mountains are moving now. Mountains are moving. Mountains are moving now. Ikimashou, let's go. Oh, dear listeners, watch how the shattered shards of all crystalline orbs suddenly vibrate and begin to swirl and coalesce into a whirlwind, swooping up Commander Athandra and her crew. Quickly, they make their way out, running as fast as they can up the main gangplank and back into their shuttle craft, swirling through the blackness of space with demonic visions hot on their trail on a wild ride toward the simian galaxy when suddenly a furious the flying unicorn sweeps past them whoosh to us all on his back wielding his ancient samurai sword annihilating all demonic crystals into insignificant smithereens of cosmic dust as the forest fairies whisper soothing messages imparting all knowledge of deep mysteries their voices overlap with excitement, singing of peace and harmony. The furious and Subasaw sweep Angela and Ithurgis up onto the flying unicorn's back, swirling through multicolored sound waves, finally landing at the top of the tallest mountain of regeneration. They ride through the weaving red threads of gravity and love, and slide into the volcanic shelf, riding the red threads of gravity and love all the way down bottom, at last emerging and landing in front of the hard castle on the peaceful side of Ethereus. At last, they are safe. Oh, we, we, we have arrived, Angela. W w where? W why here, of course. Right where we should be, on the regenerative side of Ethereus. Our forest is right over there, just beyond those pine trees across the river. Well, that's easy enough said now, if only we had a boat. <laughs> okay, silly Angela, no need for a boat. Well, oh, my poor ba 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 ba. Well, I, wait, I thought I was Commander Athandra. Oh, well, that was a dream. Yes, you are, but watch your language, Angela. Yes, yes, you are Commander Athandra in this dream. Well, sorry, oh, my poor stars, oh, my gosh. Deja vu, I've been here before. Well, of course you have. This time, you will get it right. No need for boats on Ethereus, my dear. Look, Angela, look up to remember Lord Ethereus and Tsubasa, his chief warrior. We can, we can just, just fly. fly.
Yes, Angelo. She may have forgotten, but I remember. Caraya, recuerdo yo. Just give her a second. Forest fairies warp time through red threads of gravity and love can be a bit discombobulating. Conchin está volando otra vez con una ala en el hombro izquierdo. Ay, no es posible, no es posible. Yeah, it's possible. Of course it's possible. That one-winged angel? That's Angelita, but how how odd after all these centuries. It's, it's my old samurai friend, Tsubasa. Out with it, Ethergis. What's going on? Oh, yeah, my dear Angela. Take a deep breath and tap your thymus gland to release a few calming endorphins. I remember my days in feudal Japan when I was... <sighs> you mean, yeah, I remember that. You mean when you killed Tsubasa? Yeah, Mochiron, of course. Tsubasa, my old nemesis and Lord Aetherius, will fly us across the river, and it appears we're also about to come face to face with the power of love and forgiveness itself. See there? Those red threads and ribbons weaving a carpet behind them. Hmm. That, my dear, is gravity. Gravity? But 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 gravity's an invisible force that keeps us from, from flying off into space. <sighs> oh well. In that case Yes, Mir, in that case, let's hope Tsuasa has forgiven me for killing him. A third just how could you kill your friend? Now, well, friendships in feudal Japan could be very complicated in any way. That was before I was enlightened, but put on your best manners, Angela. Where are we? We are, we are, we are. Give a century, Angela. Where do you think we are? Well, well, if I'm Commander Thondra in the future and my crew and I are swept through outer space, then we must be back in the Simeon Galaxy, uh, on the planet of... Right you are, Angela. Ethereus. We are on the planet of Ethereus, Angela. And who am I? Senor Roel? Well, once upon an Earth lifetime, perhaps. But, guess again... You're in that musical scroll that Aethergis is writing, so should I call you Aetherius? Actually, it's Lord Aetherius, as I am the ruler of the Simeon Galaxy. Oh, yeah, I remember now, Lord Aetherius. You are the lord of the planet of Aetherius. Oh, my, my earthlings are such... A clever lot. <laughs> well, it all seems like, like, in a, just another lifetime. Yeah, we're a dream, Angela. Remember that dream Grandma Gaga had? The one where you were cast in a cat food commercial. Well, yeah, a third just, but that was a dream. This is, is it? Yeah, don't worry, Angela. It will all become clear soon enough. Mavetaringa, <laughs> Angela, allow me to reach down and scoop you up onto back of Lord Aetherius. Aethergis, jump up and we fly away. Oh, wow. What, wow, what are, what are all those holes down there in the sand? Oh, those holes, my dear, are entrance to labyrinth where all evil lizard Venusians live. Well, what makes them so evil? Oh, very long time ago. Extremely sad tale, Angela. They were not evil when living on Venus. At least, I don't think so. I myself never met them in their natural habitat, but I can tell you this. They love the taste of humans and angels, snatching them up with those long, 
spiky tongue. Ew! Ew! Let's keep clear of them. That's the idea, Angela. So if you plan on rescuing Angelita, you need to be very careful. Meow, meow. I believe I foretold that story on our trip through the Tatashina Mountains with Musashi, didn't I, Disney? Didn't I, Disney? Oh, so does. Oh, boy, tonight. Who could forget? That was just before you kill me. Was not? Hmm, have you documented that yet in your musical scroll? Oh, Tsubasa, there just is on it, believe me. It's a long, big musical scroll. He's, he's working on it every every night. Tsubarashi, Tsubarashi, spectacular, so that's just so. But I forget why you kill me, the third death. Yeah, it was just aggressive sword play, way before my enlightenment, as I recall. <laughs> <laughs> That's hysterical, look. Even Ethereus is whinnying wildly and flapping his, his wings as he comes in for another hot landing toward one of the labyrinth entrances. Well, Pop, I can hardly see through all that sand flying everywhere. Oh, look, that little lizard is poking out his head out from that hole there by the lost oasis. Oh, he has no tail, and that short leg, he's, he's limping across the sand to that other hole. Oh, no, those four big lizards are chasing him. Oh, they're going to get him. Oh, hope he escapes, Pa. Oh, oh, look, look, if they're just that poor little thing. He's got no tail, and one of his legs is short. He can't possibly outrun those bullies. But, Zimothy, we've been trying to rescue him for centuries. We've almost killed him way too many times. Fly down, get closer, Ethereus. Maybe our Angela can convince him to come with us this time. He still believes gravity will kill him because of that ancient fake mythology. Zergo, Zergo, here, hey look, Zergo, we're here to rescue you. Come on, come with us. You'll be safe with us. Oh, listeners, go, go, go. If they just get the lizards, look at they just go literally. Flying at them, yowling and hissing, his tail's all bushed up. Hoo-hoo, <laughs> clawing and scratching at that evil lizard, bullying Zirko, forcing their cowardly retreat into the hole. As Zirko turns, freezes, in dismay. No! I, well, Pop, I can't understand anything. Everybody's talking all at once. What are they saying to Zirko? Oh, they're trying to convince him to come with them. True, it's that a myth. Zirko, so that was a myth. Gravity will never kill you. Zirko, you have a lie for centuries. Fake news, fake myths. Gravity is the love that binds us together. Please believe me, Zirko. Come with us, Zirko. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Let go of your fear. Zirko. Zirko, I, I, I'm Angela. I wouldn't lie to you. You're my twin. Don't you remember me? Be brave, buddy. Come on. I can't uh, 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 die, d- die if I st- st- stay out in the o- open for more, more, more than a minute. I'll, uh, I'll die. Gravity will k- k- kill me. Oh, my poor butt, Zirko, you'll die if you don't come with us. Now get a century. Come on. Wee, wee. It's fly or die time, Zirko. It's fly or die time, Zirko. Make up your mind now. Here, here, Zirko, grab my tail, Zirko. Here, let's get out of here. Oh, listener, Zirko hesitates for another few seconds and then finally grabs all of the Thurges' tail as they all fly away, just in the nick of time, leaving the evil lizard Venusians and dust devils of hot sand. Oh, that was a close one, Mother. 
thank Orb. They're safe and sound. Oh, my goodness, Orb, thank Orb, Pop. It come. looks like everyone is sitting around at a campfire there with all the other forest fairies listening to what just happened. Thank Orb. Oh, thank, thank Orb. Thank Orb. Thank Orb. Thank Orb. Thank thank you, you would have been, been killed. killed. You would have been killed, Zirko. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. It's true, 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 true. It's, it is so, so sad. I, I have such, c- c- cr- cruel and unenlightened re- 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 relatives. Mm, unfortunately, that has been the way of all living creatures for a long time. We have almost come to believe things will never change. Oh, you're right, Suvasa, but there is a better way. No one is better than anyone else. There is a way to be more loving and compassionate. Just ask Ethurgis. Por supuesto, meow. Por supuesto, of course, I am the way. That's just what Angelita says. She used to say that all the time. Before she was before she was she was used to say that. Well, calm down, forest fairies. We're here to rescue her at last. We we came to take Angelita back to Shivano. What well, well, where do you suppose she is? Yeah, look all. Do you know? Maybe you can help us. No 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 wa wa no way. Ho ho Jose, you're not g g g getting me back the there. Meow, Zirko, do you know where Angelita is? Well, I I I have s- 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 seen her y- yes in a c- 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 cage near the entrance to the lo- lo- lost oasis, but 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 she's g- 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 guarded day and n- ha- n- n- night. Ethergis, I have idea. Ethergis, I have idea. Will only work if Zirko can be convinced to. Ah uh, ah uh, ah! Uh, I heard that. I heard that. Tsubasa, no way. I'm I'm not going back now. I'm not going back now that I no 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 the truth I said no 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 way, H- H- Jose. Sounds like they're trying to hatch out a good plan and convince Circle to go along with the rescue. Look, Circle finally stomps his longest foot three times. Uh uh uh. Okay okay okay. Quiet quiet quiet. I get it. I get it. I'll I'll do it. Uh, I'll do I'll do it. I'll I'll I'll, I'll do it. Oh, good decision, Zirko. Let's go, Ikimasho. Come on, Antila. Zirko, climb aboard here. You too. You too, Ethergis. No time to waste. Oh, look, Mother Ethergis is grabbing Lord Ethergis' tail, almost not making it onto his back. Ooh, they're flying toward the sandy side. Ooh, back and forth, Ethergis is just being thrown back and forth on that tail. Ooh, look at all those holes in the labyrinth. Well, hey, Pop, let me tell it. You, wait, you? You mean Billy? Oh, okay. Okay, Billy dear. Go ahead, then. You can tell it your way. Okay, thanks, Pop. Okay. All right, dear listeners. All right. So, Suba saw an Ethergis jump off of Ethereus as he lands with a hot skid across the sand. Suba saw draws his sword, charging eastward toward the hole nearest the entrance of the last oasis. Ethergis skitters off to the westward hole on the opposite side of the Lost Oasis. Hop and Angela help Zirko down. He limps toward the north to a hole furthest from the Lost Oasis as Angela quietly kneels at the water's edge, pretending to take a drink. Got that? Okay, the lizards are guarding each entrance, but they are lured away from their posts hither and thither while Tsubasa descends into the labyrinth, defeating all guards in the sand tunnels. He frees Angelita from the cage and they flee to the surface. Tsubasa whistles for his flying unicorn, Aetherius, 
who whinnies wildly, quickly prancing over to them, bowing low to let everyone climb on. Tsubasa is in front, and with, with Angelita in front of him, then followed by Angela and Zerko, and it's there just in the rear, hanging onto the tail. <laughs> he, oh, he nearly falls off as he grabs Aetherius' tail. Oh, look, at Thurgis is being whipped back and forth as they fly over the sand dunes. Oh, my gosh. Back to the forest fairy gardens. They land and tumble off of Lord Aetherius' back. Whoosh. I'm out of breath. Oh, wait. Listen. Listen. Angela is talking to Angelita now. Well, you must be Angelita. How can you know who I am? Well, you're the only angel I've ever heard of with one wing, so who else could you be? Bintanere, Tubasa, yes? Encantaba to finally meet you, Tubasa. I've watched you from distance ever since I land in Forest Ferry gardens. Oh, and I, my dear, have lovingly watched you for centuries. Yeah, felicidades, Circle. Congratulations, Circle. It is muy valiente. You are very courageous. The, 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 the thanks, the third, just, I, I did, 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 didn't think I could, could do, do, do it. Oh, I always knew you had it in you, Zerko. You're the bomb. But just wait till you show those bullies at the high school, and you'll show them a thing or two. High school b b bullies? What, 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 what do you mean? mean? We're going home, Zerko. Back to Crestone. You too, Lord Etherius. Mom really misses Senor Roel, and, and she needs you back. Oh, oh, I miss Wisteria, too. Oh, 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 I can fly us back. We're all going home. We, we are? are? Yes. It's your dish. And are you going to take me with you? I must return to Chabano. We we are? Are? Yes, of course, Angelita. We came all this way just to get you back to him. But, but how'd you do this? I'll fly us to the seventh wormhole. Then I can, 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 can use, use her, 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 her to transport everyone instantaneously back to Crestone. Oh, Let's go. Let's go. Well, dear listeners, who? Oh. We'll just have to come back for the next episode to find out what happens next. This is Billy Ruth Hopkins for Richie with KCIW 100.7 on your FM dial right here in beautiful downtown Brookings where every day is an awesome day and we can always choose to say yes. Life is indeed very, very good. Remember to catch us on podcast at kciw.org forward slash Angelita's Wings. That's a N G E L I T A S dash wings. Until next time. <laughs>